Hi ARK fans, welcome to ARK Invest Daily, your daily dose of ARK information. Today, uh, it was a green day for ARK, so that's good. We'll see by how much in just a bit. And also, we'll be putting spotlight on our daily watch list, the four companies that we follow always, because sometimes they may or may not show up in the biggest move section. So we have created a separate section for it, uh, where we follow Nano Dimension, Palantir, DraftKing, and Scales. We do a diff from yesterday or whatever is the previous trade day and uh, find out what's the difference in the position uh, in various ETFs of ARK. So stay with me, please like and subscribe. That's a free way to show your support. It takes a lot of uh, time and effort to build these videos um, and the charts that I bring to you. So I highly appreciate uh, the like and subscribe. Thank you so much. Welcome back friends. Uh, so today we are looking at uh, Monday's performance. In ARK summary section, we keep an eye on market value number. This is the trend of market value of all the eight ETFs combined. Today it's up from yesterday, 1.4%, uh, not so much, but still it's it's up, it's green, 46.26 billion. This is how that 46.26 billion is divided in all the eight ETFs, ETFs that they have. Um, Israel being the smallest, RK being the biggest, uh, almost 50% of the value. Um, Israel is smallest in market value, but biggest in number of companies that they are invested in, uh, 77. Sometimes early July is when they increase this number. They invested a, in a lot of Israel companies and uh, that's how this count became the highest. Uh, there is an episode about it. Uh, if you are interested in which companies those are, uh, you can go and watch that in one of the previous episodes. Total number of company remains constant 288 for past few days as you can see, um, but overall uh, for the day range that we have selected, the trend seems to be downward. Uh, but anyways, uh, today there is no new company added or no company was removed. Let's quickly go over the biggest moves, make it a short video because there was hardly any trading done. Um, the threshold that we have today is at least 1% of shares added or removed and market value change of $2 million. Um, these are the companies that satisfy that criteria. This is their ranking in the 288 companies that ARK is invested in. So the highest one being Soaring Eagle, Soaring Eagle acquisition, 93% uh, extra shares added there, rank 64, relatively new company too. And very high up in the ranking looks like it's present in two ETFs, RK and RG, causing a difference of 70 million, showing super high confidence value in this company all of a sudden uh, right now looks like. Uh, stock price going to $10. That's generally where most of the SPACs are at $10. That's where they start. So, um, yeah. And as soon as the merger happens it, the uh, in it, for all the SPACs, it's uh, generally a trend that it goes up for a short time and then goes back down. So that's what we have seen in past. Um, but this is uh, this is the uh, this is Soaring Eagle acquisition. This is uh, what we have seen in past for various SPACs. May or may not happen for this. Adaptive Biotechnologies, 6% uh, extra shares added, uh, causing a difference of 7.6 million present in RG. Um, so they have uh, had a pretty sizable amount of shares in past and today all of a sudden they have added a lot more. Um, yeah, 7.6 million difference. Too simple, 5% extra shares causing a difference of 13.9 present in two ETFs, RQ and RK. Uh, Zillow Group, 1% extra shares um, added in, uh, made a difference of 18.2 million. Um, in terms of negative, let's take a look. Pure storage is the biggest one, 62% removed, 17.6 million uh, difference in the market value. Sears, uh, Sear Inc., uh, this is 29% removed. Netflix, 12% removed. Nvidia, 7%. Novart is 7, 5%. Roche Holdings, 4%. C, 2%. Uh, and Nintendo, 2%. Um, it should not reflect on the company's evaluation or com uh, the how good these companies are. Uh, because some of these are really, 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 really good companies. And uh, what they do is they generally take the profits or treat them as cash and then they invest in the companies where they think there is more value. So in this case, yep, all of these are pretty good companies actually. Um, I removed some shares from there and put it in Soaring Eagle looks like. Uh, but anyways, that's what it looks like from these numbers. Let's take a look at, uh, let's make this as zero, right? So whether trading happened or not, but let's see the difference in market value because of stock price uh, changes. So Coinbase is the biggest one, as you can see, but purely based on stock price changing, hardly any change in the um, uh, number of shares. Tesla, again, purely stock price change. Soaring Eagle, we looked at it. Unity Software, ranks seven, pretty high ranking company, uh, 40.6 uh, million difference today, but purely based on stock price. Uh, Palantir, 30 million difference purely on stock price, Square, UiPath. So these are some of the big moves, but purely based on um, stock price movement, because as you can see, there is hardly any 
uh, stock um, a total number of shares movement in in these stock ones so that's the story of today um, we already went over these the, the biggest negative one is in Telia therapeutics because stock price went down hardly any movement on shares there as well so I'm going to hover over these so you can take a look now let's uh, go over uh, there is no newer remove company so we're skipping that section but let's jump directly to daily watch list where we keep an eye on uh, these four companies so this is the difference from Friday snapshot to today's snapshot um, so a little bit of shares added uh, this is not even one percent it's point zero something percent and hence it's rounding to zero percent change in shares um, uh, so uh, that's the that's the difference there you can see uh, let's see this guy stock price slightly ticking upward and hence it's showing as positive 1.8 million uh, scale stock price uh, taking upward and then adding just 14 14,660 which is uh, which is nothing at all compared to how much how many shares they have um, stock price ticking upward and hence taking it to 10.3 million overall market value change Valentier uh, stock price ticking upward again and uh, uh, making a difference of 30.1 million to the overall market value of this company that they hold uh, draft kings again same story stock price uh, climbing up a little bit and hence 11 million difference in the market value shares i wouldn't worry about this this is more like adjustment hardly any changes i would say uh, so we are not going to go into the trends uh, because there is hardly any change so it's all good but let me quickly show you how the change is uh, how it works though so if i click on draft king it will show me the trend of how they have been holding DraftKing and uh, this is the share count and this is the market value so they have 0.72 billion um, worth of uh, market value for DraftKings if we break it by ETF you'll see it's uh, mostly in RK then RW and then RKF so um, whenever there is a big change we will take a look at it here and see what happened there but uh, that's your daily dose guys and uh, please like and subscribe I'll see you tomorrow with the Tuesday update